Hi, it's Jeff Wade here with StockIdeas.org, and I'm going to do another quick book review for you. Uh, today we're looking at The Dark Genius of Wall Street um, by Edward J. Renahan Jr., and this book is about the misunderstood life of Jay Gould, King of the Robber Barons. Um, so I actually read a book uh, last year that one of my YouTube viewers uh, recommended in the comment section called uh, The First Tycoon, The Epic Life of Cornelius Vanderbilt. Uh, and you can browse through my channel for that book review you if you want. And, uh, you know, this summer I was just looking for another book about, uh, you know, one of these robber barons uh, from the Gilded Age, one of the great capitalists of the late 1800s. Uh, you know, when America was... You know, the biggest industries were railroads and steamships. Uh, and, you know, in uh, the other book, uh, The First Tycoon, it's about Cornelius Vanderbilt. And one of the people that he butts heads with on regular occasion is Jay Gould. Um, and in the Vanderbilt book, you know, Jay Gould is uh, really portrayed as uh, a dark genius of Wall Street. You know, they really make him out to be an evil guy. Uh, so when I saw this book, um, sort of touting the other side of the story, I was really curious uh, to check it out, and I'm really glad I did. Uh, this is a great biography, you know, of one of the great capitalists uh, of, of America, and, uh, you know, it's just fascinating uh, to read about these guys that started from nothing, um, you know, a poor, growing up poor in the Catskills in upstate New York, uh, getting to start in the leather tanning business, and, uh, then just making moves from there and snowballing his wealth uh, to build a really huge fortune. Uh, so it's just inspiring, it's just exciting, uh, and you know, it, you can always learn something uh, from these great success stories. And, you know, for me, uh, this one, you know, I think the book does uh, do a good job of you know, kind of shedding some light on the truth about Jay Gould. Um, you know, if you, common history, common uh, knowledge about Jay Gould is that he was, you know, a, a real jerk, uh, you know, really willing to do anything to make a buck. Um, and to an extent that was true, but, you know, this book also, you know, points out some factual inaccuracies about the kind of common myth of Jay Gould. It also, um, you know, talks about how he kind of uh, fostered this bad guy image. Uh, you know, he gave a ton of money to charity, but he did it anonymously because he didn't want it to undermine his image as, like, a ruthless businessman. Uh, so really kind of fascinating to dig deeper um, into the life of Jay Gould, um, you know, to learn about the battles uh, for control of the different railroads, all the different stock manipulations and schemes that they pl planned, um, you know, with his... Uh, our old friend Daniel Drew. Uh, it's just it's just a great summer reading. Um, you know, it's there's no uh, trading secrets or success to investing tips in it. Um, but you know, just the wisdom and uh, the approach and the knowledge, you know, is really exciting and inspiring, uh, motivating and aspirational for anyone who's interested in in finance and sort of making the name for themselves. Uh, so for those reasons alone. I highly recommend The Dark Genius of Wall Street. Uh, you know, it was a really interesting read, really fascinating, um, just a great financial biography. So if you're looking for some, uh, you know, entertaining uh, yet educational reading, I, uh, I highly recommend The Dark Genius of Wall Street. Um, additionally, if you're, you're kind of curious and want to read a little bit more, uh, I'd encourage you to just uh, hit the link below this video. You'll see there's a link to stockideas.org. Uh, there you can read a much more in-depth book review. Uh, you can also click through to Amazon and check out uh, you know, the reviews there and see if uh, The Dark Genius of Wall Street is uh, the right finance biography for you. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll uh, be back at you soon with more book reviews. Thanks very much.